How much does it really cost to stay warm in Canada? Did you know that heating takes up about 80% of a typical Canadian household's energy use? It's the single biggest chunk of your energy bill. Space and water heating dominate the equation. But how much does it actually cost to stay warm during those freezing winters? And more importantly, how can you lower those costs without sacrificing comfort? Let's break it down types of heating systems, costs across Canada, and the smartest ways to save this winter. Stick around, your wallet will thank you. What uses the most energy in Canadian homes? It's not your fridge or washing machine causing energy spikes, it's heating. Here's how energy consumption stacks up. Space heating takes up just over 60% of the energy used, followed by water heating at about 17%. Appliances account for only 14%. Yes, your dishwasher isn't as guilty as you thought. Lighting uses just 3.5% on average, especially with energy-saving LEDs. Space cooling, thanks to Canada's traditionally shorter summers, is only 1% or 2% overall. The data is somewhat skewed by the fact that air conditioning was less common in many parts of the country. But that is changing and overall electricity consumption for air conditioning is rising. So where you live and how you heat your home really impacts your bills. Let's dive into those provincial differences. Which provinces have the highest heating costs? If you live in the Northwest Territories, brace yourself. Electricity rates soar up to 41.0 cents per kilowatt hour, the highest in Canada. Meanwhile, Quebec boasts the lowest rates at just 7.8 cents per kilowatt hour thanks to abundant hydropower, making it a haven for electric heating users. Why the disparity? It boils down to infrastructure, resource availability, and to some extent energy taxes like the carbon tax, although for most people that is at least partially offset by rebate payments. Average heating costs across Canada. On average, Canadians pay $135 per month for heating. Propane users may see higher bills due to more expensive fuel costs, while natural gas users typically see average monthly costs of $160 during winter months. In regions like Quebec, where electricity is cheaper, electric heating can cost as little as $110 per month on average. However, rising energy prices are making life harder. Over the past year, natural gas prices surged by 23.7%, while electricity rates saw a more modest increase of 1.6%. Shockingly, 14% of households reported keeping their homes at unsafe temperatures to avoid soaring bills. At worst, 15% had to cut back on essentials like food and medicine just to afford heating. Breaking down heating costs by system. First, gas furnaces. These systems cost between $5.50 and $8 per day in winter, depending on the furnace size, efficiency, and insulation. For electric heat pumps, efficiency shines here. Expect to pay around $115 per month for a 4,000 watt unit running five hours daily. Finally, propane furnaces. These can be costly with annual expenses ranging from $2,000 to $3,000 for homes using propane heating. How to cut your heating costs. One, seal drafts. Plugging air leaks can save up to 20% on heating bills. Two, get a smart thermostat. Automating temperature settings can lead to an 8% annual energy reduction. Three, maintenance matters. Annual tune-ups ensure your furnace runs efficiently. Four, upgrade windows. Double glazed windows can slash heat loss by 50%. Pro tip, lower your thermostat by just one degree. Each degree can cut heating costs by 2%. Small change, big impact. Heating is a necessity in Canada, but it doesn't have to break the bank. By choosing the right system, sealing those drafts, and tapping into government incentives, you can keep your home warm and your costs low. And remember, if your HVAC system needs an upgrade, our nationwide network of professionals is here to help. Get a quote today and make this winter your most efficient yet. And if you found this video helpful, hit the like button and drop a comment.